I'm in Econ 102 right now, uh, and it is difficult. Math 105, which is integral calculus. For sure, organic chemistry, chemistry 233, it was brutal. It's probably a toss-up between Psych 350, human sexuality or Psych 361, which is physiology motivation. Philosophy 314, which was 17th century philosophy. I had no idea what was going on. Like, I couldn't understand if what was being said was hypothetical. AS114, it was not for me because I wasn't used to the style of um, testing, the multiple choice thing. The introductory psych courses, I'm in kinesiology and a lot of kin is mostly memorization, which is what I'm used to, which is what I'm good at. But in courses like psychology, it's more about understanding concepts. A lot more about attributing the knowledge and the information that we get to the real world rather than spitting it back out on a piece of paper. Doing a lot of research outside of class when you don't understand concepts really helps and you can realize that something's actually a lot more interesting than it seemed. You cannot do math in within two days. You ha it's supposed to be an ongoing practice. You gotta stay on top of those readings. You work hard and you put in the hours and the effort and you go to your profs and you collaborate with others, you can succeed in these courses. Even though you think you have to have natural talent to do something, if you really work hard at it, you can succeed. You don't have to memorize everything. Just gotta work hard, that's a big thing. Mm -hmm.